Okay, students, now we are going to solve your next numerical problem at your textbook, uh, which is 9.2. I'm going to read the statements, so listen carefully. Uh, yellow sodium light of wavelength 589 uh, nanometer emitted by a single source passes through two narrow slits uh, 1.00 millimeter apart. The interference pattern is observed on a screen uh, 225 centimeter away. How far apart two adjacent bright fringes? Okay, students, to uh, solve this numerical problem, uh, we are going to write the given data in solution. So, in solution, uh, we have given in the statement, uh, first we have given the wavelength of yellow sodium light, which is uh, lambda. So, you can write the wavelength by representing lambda 589 nanometer. And you know very well, 1 nanometer equals 10 raised to the power minus 8, minus 9 meter. So, the other thing is given as the slit spacing, uh, the distance between two slits, like the first exam, numerical example D, which is given as 1.00 millimeter. I think so. That is given as 1.00 millimeter, and you know very well what. 1 millimeter contain 10 to the power minus 3. So you can write this D as 1 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter. So, and the other thing which is given as uh, the interference pattern is observed on the screen 225 centimeter. Look, they're like this. We have our slits here, and the screen is here. So the distance between the slits and screen which is 2 to 5 centimeter. So students, we can write this as L 2 to 5 centimeter. Okay, first we will convert this centimeter into meter by dividing the 100. So when we divide 225 by 100, we will have 2.25 meter. You can divide this, you can uh, take this approach by using calculator, okay? So, another thing, what we will have to find out how far apart are two adjacent brine fringes. Like there, I raise the diagram or So here is the central point. We will have to find out how far apart two adjacent bright fringes. Say this is the central point and this is two adjacent bright fringes like this is delta y. We will have to find out delta y. We delta y is to hai. Two bright fringes, two adjacent bright fringes ke jo distance hai, jo spacing actually we have to find out. Karne hai. Okay, uh, what we will have to find out? We will have to find out delta y. So students, now you can use our formula same as before. Delta y equals lambda l over d. Okay, simply uh, we will uh, substitute the values of the given uh, variables, lambda, wavelength, distance between the spacing, uh, distance between the screen and slits L and the interspacing distance between the slits D. So, values put karte hain, uh, 5, 8, 9, 10 raised to the power minus 9 multiply 2.25 divided by 1 into 10 raised to power minus 3. Okay, dear students, uh, you can solve this by using calculator. You will, we will just multiply the above numerators two terms. Then you will have single term. Then you can divide that single numerator by denominator 1 to 10 raised to power minus 3. Or you can solve this simultaneously on your scientific calculator. So by solving this, you can have 
uh, delta y as 1.33 into 10 raised to power minus 3 meter and you know very well 10 raised to power minus 3 equals milli so you can have millimeter 1.33 millimeter which is the adjacent spring uh, two bright adjacent fringes distance so in this way you can solve this numerical